I'm Matt Burns. I'm a technical marketing manager at Samtech. I'm also on the, the marketing working group within the PCI SIG community. Today we're going to be talking about the unique advantages that PCI Express technology uh, and how it applies to AI and ML applications. There are a lot of unique challenges in designing AI and ML applications. Uh, the exuberance around ChatGPT has really awakened within the general public the power and influence that AI can have on everyone's life. The challenge for software designers, hardware designers, system designers is how do you route all that data throughout the system? Uh, in addition, uh, when we look at in the AI and ML uh, application space, there's not one hardware platform uh, that's driving all the demand, right? There's GPUs, there's CPUs, there's FPGAs, there's SOCs. How do you tie those things together? That's really where, where PCI Express uh, adds a lot of value. Uh, so, you know, whether it's high speed, whether it's low, you know, scalability, whether it's flexibility, whether it's uh, low power mode, uh, PCI Express is obviously preferred technology for tying those hardware solutions together. What makes PCI Express technology uh, so efficient to use within AI and ML applications is the fact that PCI Express uh, Chem AICs are so well known. Not only can you build uh, accelerators very easily, no matter what the uh, ASIC technology is, you can also scale uh, system architectures very quickly. And as we mentioned, since ChatGPT Chat has become so popular, there's ever evolving uh, data sets within AI ML that continue to grow exponentially. So if you're designing for AI, AI and ML applications or AI and ML verticals, it's easy to scale by adding more AI accelerators uh, in your servers or your compute platforms using uh, PCI Express uh, Chem AIC form factors. One of the advantages of PCI Express technology is the fact that it's doubling in data rate every two to three years. So AI chipset vendors, AI accelerator uh, developers uh, have a, a clear path because of what PCI SIG uh, as a consortium uh, has done for the industry. Uh, in addition, uh, with some of the latest uh, PCI specifications, PCI 5, PCI 6, uh, as AI data sets grow in size, not only is speed increasing, but power is a concern. So having low power modes like uh, the LP0 within uh, the PCI 6 uh, standard is appealing for AI and ML chipset vendors, application uh, providers, and the like. The artificial intelligence and machine learning industry and vertical is, is rapidly ex expanding. And the, the amount of change in the industry is, is growing at, at what seems at an exponential rate. Not only are there uh, suppliers in the market that are leaders uh, in their respective spaces, depend, no, no matter what their solutions are, we also are seeing a number of startups that are bound to uh, influence how the industry goes in terms of hardware architectures and, and things like that. The ubiquity or the, uh, the ease of understanding and the widespread uh, reach that PCI Express technology has adds value not only to existing vendors and suppliers, but also to startups that are just starting or startups to come. Uh, so that really uh, helps uh, to uh, influence the evolution of, uh, P of AI and ML applications uh, because of the, the, how easy it is to use PCI Express as a fabric between uh, a CPU, a GPU, an FPGA, an SOC memory, or whatever the case may be uh, when it comes to system architectures. In addition, AI and ML uh, hardware architectures are yet to be defined. You know, what works today may not work in the future, um, but based on the uh, ever-evolving uh, capabilities of PCI uh, Express technology, PCI 6 at 64, PCI 7 at 128, and whatever comes in the future, there's a strong roadmap of uh, performance, scalability, flexibility, low power mode that PCI Express technology provides for future uh, AI ML system architectures. AI uh, and machine learning verticals continue to be a focus for PCI SIG. So for more information and the, and the latest uh, tools that are available, visit PCISIG.com.